Today we open a new chapter of air power in Europe. Uh, with this deployment of the F-22 to Spangdalem, we do three things that are very important. The first is to send a very clear message to our European allies that we're committed to peace and security here, that we will bring our most capable asset in the F-22 here. The second is to learn to train alongside of our other American airmen who are here, at, uh, the U.S. Air Force units, our joint partners and our NATO allies. And lastly, it's to validate our thinking and how we operate this airplane. Most importantly, he says, we're reassuring our European allies of our commitment to peace and security in this region. And they go, yes, During his visit with the airmen and members of the 52nd Fighter Wing, he sees firsthand the leadership, innovation, and dedication to the mission. This is my first immersion uh, to, to see what happens here at Spangdalem, and I'm very impressed with what goes on. I look at how they've moved around the theater, how they flex to meet the requirements. It's very humbling to see how great a job they do every day flying the F-16, maintaining it, and getting the mission to happen. But I'm impressed not just with the mission, but with the local community and the ties that they have. He says it's no coincidence the F-22s are here. Our most advanced, most capable fighter to Europe to send a signal to our commitment. There is no better place or no better choice than Spangdalem to start that. From Spangdalem Air Base, Germany, I'm Air Force Staff Sergeant Alyssa Juhas.